you have a child online all the time doing virtual school. How do you reduce their exposure to wireless radiation? I mean, it just seems all so complicated, people have said to me. So it's really simple. All you need to do is get an ethernet cord like this. Um, I have 50 feet, 20 feet. They are very inexpensive. You can buy them online. Get your ethernet cord that has a plug that looks like this you um, plug it into your computer. If you can't plug it into your computer, you get an adapter. It looks like this. This is an Apple. It goes from Ethernet. See how it's got the Ethernet port, so it plugs right in. And then it's got a USB plug. Um, maybe you have a lightning port. Then you just get one that has a lightning port on the other side. So it's Ethernet to USB or Ethernet to lightning and you can plug in your laptop, Chromebooks, uh, make sure that the make and model matches. So if you have an Apple device, buy an Apple adapter. I hate to say it, but the other ones sometimes work, sometimes don't, it gets a little challenging. And if you have a PC, uh, you can look up the make and model and just make sure that it's compatible. It's that easy. Once you hook that up, be sure to turn the antennas off of the laptop or Chromebook. So you need to uh, go to the settings and turn the Wi-Fi off. Don't forget to also turn off Bluetooth and to turn off any other antennas that are running around on the device. So maybe you have um, a mobile hotspot antenna or something like that. So easy and once you're done, there is no radiation coming out of the device. So that really can cut down on the exposure to your child.